Hi, this is Justin from Tech65 and today we are here at the Nokia launch of several phones. But today we want to take a look at, uh, do a run through with what's so special about Simbim Bell and the operating system itself that will be coming in the Nokia 700, the 701 and the 603. And today we have here a Nokia representative, uh, Joseph, with us today to just show us what's, so, what's the improvements and what's great about uh, Symbian Bell. So can you tell us what's great about Symbian Bell? Yep, so Symbian Bell uh, is one of the latest releases that we have for OS uh, improvements uh, to the Nokia Symbian 3 range. Okay, this will be made available uh, also to existing Symbian 3 smartphones, uh, namely Nokia N8, C7, C601, E7 and Nokia 500. Now, what happens is that uh, Symbian Bell, uh, there are some, uh, ma some major UI layout improvements. First of all, okay, if you notice, the the status bar here basically has been changed from a text base to icon base. Now this is to complement with uh, the main menu uh, icon layout. Okay. Uh, the other thing, if you notice now, you shift your view to the top. You have a revised status bar. Now this status bar can be reached at any point in time uh, when you are in the menu, as well as the home screen. And what you can see here are all your updates. Your missed calls, your text messages that are, that are just come in. You can also have easy access to applications that are open like your music player. Now that's one portion here for notifications. Now at the top here are four new icons. Okay, what happens is that Nokia have uh, decided to uh, have checked and uh, gotten feedback to as to what are the most important um, instant access items that users would find important to them. Now first of all, of course, we have the usual silent mode. Just one swipe and a tap and yep you are in the silent mode, you can step safely into your meeting or in the cinema. Next up, of course, you have a new feature that we call uh, mobile data. Now, okay, if you are traveling uh, overseas and you are conscious of uh, your data, all you need to do is just tap once here and your mobile data is off. So your connections are all killed off and you no need to worry about uh, data roaming costs. Want to turn it back on, just tap here again. So this is uh, one of the other cool new features that's been added. Okay, other features, uh, out of the box, you'll notice that the menu is flat now. No folders are available. Okay, however, of course, users can still choose to add new folders if they wish to. And um, one, another feature available, uh, or rather improvement, uh, that's been added in, of course, is with the new 1 gigahertz processor support, um, things are much easier, or uh, rather smoother. Okay, as you can see, if I shift things around, there's no visible light whatsoever when I do... Um, the arrangement of the icons. One of the major, other major features that we have included also is the home screen. Now with Bell, okay, um, we have effectively doubled the number of home screens that you can customize. We have up to six now. So if, for example, I start with this home screen, that's one, two, three, four, five, and six different home screens that you can customize. And you may also notice Widgets now are also uh, we will now also come in different shapes and sizes. We have up to five different sh uh, sh shaped widgets, of which uh, you can also customize and move around. They are not limited to uh, a specific place. And of course, one of the great new features of uh, Symbian Bell is that it now supports NFC uh, integrated. What happens is that uh, it allows you to do pairing, it allows you to do sharing, even discovering uh, new content, and uh, it allows you to do a uh, great new multiplayer gaming features. Now, first of all, by sharing, or rather, sorry, for pairing, what happens is that with this Play360 speaker, which is NFC enabled, and it's also uh, by Nokia, I'm, a, I'm able to seamlessly pair and uh, stream music directly without the hassle of turning on my Bluetooth here, finding for that device, selecting it, entering password if needed, so on and so forth. All I need to do if I'm playing this song, connecting and after that and then I'm disconnected real easy fast fast free hassle free and it's a great way to interact with uh, NFC accessories so next thing you can do with NFC is sharing now there are multitudes of uh, things that you can share contacts videos um, bookmarks and even business cards so what happens is that, let's say if there's a particular image that I like, this one of the default ones available. Here I have the Nokia 700, which is another NFC enabled device. All I need to do, just tap. 
and then this will automatically share over to this device and as you can see the progress bar it just goes right over it's very easy so now that it's received it'll automatically open up and there you go so that's for sharing now you can do this the same thing with uh, bookmarks and uh, business cards as well so this is really cool and hassle free one of the other cool features would be for discovering new content. Now, NFC uh, allows you to interact with uh, the tags to find new content and to uh, discover on what's new. For example, we have done a collaboration or uh, rather a partnership with uh, ComfortDelGro here. So this effectively allows you at a single touch to book a taxi. That's it. You know, you have to call the uh, back then or uh, even at this point, you still have to call a number. Okay, uh, wait, on the, uh, wait on the line, get to the operator, so on and so forth. Now, all you have to do here, just need to tap and send. That's it. That's all you have to do at this particular location here at Singapore Arts Museum. You just send it over and you get your confirmation via SMS. There are other things as well. For example, if let's say there's a poster here advertising for a particular outlet or even a brand, all I need to do, tap here, NFC. I'll be brought to a landing page. In this case, follow us on Twitter. That's actually the restaurant. I press OK. It opens up the page. And then I can see the page to like. Very simple. So um, there are many other things that you can do also uh, with uh, discovering. Right now, we also have a tie-up with Net National Heritage Board. Uh, you can go down to Bras Basa MRT to find out more. We have a huge signage over there. All right, and that's it for the Symbian Bell. Um, lots of NFC stuff, lots of great improvements in terms of the UI. You know, it's, I think it's a, a great improvement for and a great upgrade to the existing phones for the Nokia uh, running Symbian Anna right now. So yes, um, that's Symbian Bell. Thank you very much for watching.